Got the Polaris boys. Hey, how's the snow been? Great, let's go rip some pow. Okay. Oh my God. This is pretty wild, man. I've never driven up a logging road out here that isn't covered in snow. I, I've never seen this any time of year. And it is middle of winter. I like, it's mind blowing. I feel really bad for everybody that's booked their trip out here right now or the businesses that rent sleds, hotels. And then the people that do have their trips booked, oh man, hopefully it's not your first trip and you get out more than once a year because these are some, some tough conditions. But uh, we're gonna go up today, make the most of it. You know, I ride every day of the year, so it doesn't really bother me. It's still an adventure, still gonna be a good time with the guys. So uh, we'll get up there, see what we find as usual. I, I literally, I didn't even know what the, the forest looked like here without snow in it, because I've never been here when there's no snow. We're now over two kilometers up the mountain and we're just getting to our first patch of snow. And now we're at two and a half K and the road is pretty snow covered. You don't have to take the side panels off already, do you? Yeah. Fire sale, actually. <laughs> Everything must go. You got a plug wrench there, a little plug swap. Those were old anyway. Got some ski rubber maintenance going on here. You see that one? Oh yeah. It's like just too brittle of, ru of rubber. Uh, Jordan's already getting his lunch in. Off with the whole eating. <laughs> <laughs> yep, priorities. Nine R, nine R, nine R, nine R. We're riding with Ben, Jordan, and Hugo today. The Jerry's went home yesterday. That is it for the Jerry's. The They're heading out. Hey, Dad. <laughs> that would have been something. We should have kept driving up the road. I'm not sure what's supposed to hold that down. So we really have no idea what we're doing today or where we're going. Uh, we're just on an adventure. That's what we're doing. It is kind of hard to adventure when there's no snow though. I think we're still going up but the snow's getting less. Basically what I think we're trying to do today is go up a hiking trail. Uh, yeah. If we go this way, the logging road just doesn't bring us very very high. Yeah. Hiking or hiking trail is boring. But as well as no mobile or hiking. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta use that line. <laughs> Alright, let's go up. in the world. How many meters are we at here? We're 1100 meters and we're still riding dirt. Holy shit. <laughs> oh my god. The nice thing about there being uh, no snow is it doesn't bother us going out and burning a day something stupid, doing something stupid like this because we're not missing out on any good riding. Oh, it's starting to look pretty good here. Our original plan was not to come up here, but we realized the road that's low doesn't go high enough to get us into any good snow. So we pretty much had to go this way to get up to, we're almost at 1500 meters now. Oh, this is it. <laughs> In the wise words of Hugo, it's boring to hike a hiking trail. I'd rather snowmobile. So we'll see how this goes. So there is actually other tracks up this hiking trail. It's a pretty nice hiking trail so far. It is rated a black diamond though. We also just stopped back here and realized it's below freezing at this elevation now. So 
it's gonna get cooler the higher we go up, which is not what we want. It's gonna make it so there's a really bad crust up here, so you can feel it starting already. We don't have to follow the hiking trail, of course, so. choice yep we're walking pretty much right on top of the crust here <laughs> oh yeah that's a good one got jordan back on his feet here somebody in the bush over here this is gonna be scary going down jordan are these conditions are better worse or the same as what you expected I'd say what I expected. Yeah. I mean, I didn't really come and intend on riding at this elevation. <laughs> what elevation well, do these, you want to ride at? In these trees, like the steeps when it's getting crusty. <laughs> That's no good there. I think we're below the hiking trail now. energy but this is why we took the frickin Blairs works so well in these conditions that is gonna suck going back down <laughs> we got Ben <laughs> Straight in the tree. Now it gets a little easier, I think. That was pretty fun, though. Oh, I mean, yeah. gnarly, but. There was three times where I was like, holy F, Matt. Like, <laughs> I had to get a little aggressive there a couple times. The last one there. Yeah. This is what we're looking at now for the ice crest up here, almost 1,700 meters, and it's still, it's it's firm below that. You can hardly even tell a snowmobile has been through here. Some sweet lines though. <laughs> Oh, 
I'll give you a hand if you give me lunch. <laughs> Are you stuck? Well, sounds like Hugo needs a hand because he's upside down in a tree. So we're looping back down and around. He's pretty far down there. Uh, I think I'll be all right, actually. He said he thinks he might be okay, so just give him a second. <laughs> what is he? Looks like he's faced he right into that big tree now. <laughs> Concrete. Eins, zwei, drei. So he goes in the trees back there, but I think if we drop down this, he should be able to side hill through the trees, come out here, and this way would be a little easier but it's so foggy through here, I can't really tell what I'm looking at. All right, we can't really see what we're looking at here, but we're gonna try and drop in anyway. Oh yeah, this is, this is fine. We're waiting for nothing. We left our sleds behind and we're walking to him. He should just be up here. We found a new route for you. That's not bad, eh? Like for a slow walk. Yeah, downhill. Yeah. We're hiking on the hiking trail after all, eh? <laughs> <laughs> That's how we're doing. Uh, I think the marked trail should be somewhere through here. Nice. That's sick. Walk go the... Oh, I got a tree. Just got the quick draw saw. Are gonna shoot up yeah, it's pretty steep through this next spot. Uh oh, we're losing elevation. Here you go. I think we should reposition. Kind of, kind of worked out any better. Still on track. Holy, that is so bouncy. Okay, let's see if we can go. That's reverse! difficult conditions. Let's just put my helmet in the snow so it doesn't roll away here. Um, how tough is that? It's hard. Up that side, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay, let's give this another go here. Oh, <laughs> 
Do we want to go straight up that? It looks pretty scary if we have to come down. This is getting really dicey. Look at my tracks. It's getting scary. It is. Yeah, this is the top right here. Well, we were there. We did it. Look at that check here. And like the cool guys do, we'll dive in. Everyone, if you're not here already, you better be. Look, we made a heart in the snow. That's how much I love the conditions. Oh, you did too. Pretty well executed. Is that where the pow is? Yeah, down there. Down there. Careful, don't get stuck. Not even paddle deep. Look, the paddles are in the air. What do you think? Awesome. <laughs> Looks pretty cool, actually. <laughs> I mean, the loop. The connection was cool. The connection was cool. That was sweet. We're looking to see if we could drop down right here. Um, not really sure. Feel like it might be a cliff right here because I do see a bunch of sled tracks down there and none up here. So there's a ton of wet snow slides through here too. Is it worth dropping in? Well, yeah, either we go back or we go to the cabin for for lunch and then just come back this way. Either way back up is actually gonna be easy because on the left side, you just come from higher up on the hill. You just side hill straight across. You don't even have to drop down. Looks a little steeper looking back up at it. Oh. I might have to put my scratchers down. Overheating. Well, unfortunately, we're kind of calling our mission early here. It's already three o'clock. And going out this way is gonna be tricky enough as it is. Oh, this is tiring. so crispy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. We're working our way back down through here and I am not sure what the plan is after today. If we're going to try and keep riding in this, if we're going to go home to Ontario for a week. Uh, yeah. If we're gonna go on a road trip elsewhere to find some snow, we got some options, but just gotta figure out what we're gonna do because continuing to ride in this doesn't seem like the most, <laughs> the best option. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> That's gonna be tough. So you cannot go down here. You have to make this bench. <laughs> How do you think being last is? Bad. Yeah. <laughs> The rest is a breeze. I don't know if the trail was down there or up there. The trail just slowly moves downhill. Okay. Uh oh. I thought you were going to try and jump it. I was going to, but I kind of lost my track. Oh, Ben's going for your line. Arguably, this is more fun than anything we've had. Before. Oh, yeah. This is way more fun than up top. Come on, you go get her. You got a gas. Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> He's on the log. He's like skinny. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him using his foot to try and get the sled back. Oh yeah, there. Oh, oh, almost. Yeah, now you got a log ride. That's. That's not. He's gonna need a truck. Oh yeah. He's still, he's still on it. <laughs> He's only got one line here though. He's gotta come up to us. <laughs> here I got ya! That's good stuff right there. All right guys, how would everyone rate their hike on a scale of one to 10? Would have been better hike if I had snowshoes. You mean ice picks? Yeah, ice picks. Ice climbing actually would be fun. <laughs> Maybe we should try that tomorrow. Three or four out of ten, just because it's still a day on the mountain. Yeah, next time I'll bring better hiking boots because I have blisters. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, put some uh, strap-on cleats. That's what we'll bring. It's not the only strap-on Ben's gonna have. Any. <laughs> <laughs> no, I still give it a solid six. It was an adventure. Yeah, yeah. I it's guess good. one of us answered the question. I'll give it a seven or seven. seven there or you ten. go. Good, good six. I struggle, right, but made it back in. Getting broken yeah. thing, so. <laughs> once we once we got you out of that one spot, you were fine. Right. <laughs> After the rollover to yeah. the tree. <laughs> we better take the shortcut. <laughs> uh -oh. to the guys a little while ago I can't even really like complain about the conditions at this point you know I'm, I'm still happy to be out here snowmobile all winter long like but 
seeing what the conditions are right now is almost it's almost comical how bad it is i just feel for all the guys that have their vacations planned to come out right now all the businesses that rely on this Know the Polaris's pack, eh? Look how good this skidoo is. Polaris, take notes. 